деді. An incubating Burmese rock python was recently spotted inside the park. And the authority decided to monitor and study the entire hatching process and also to offer protection to the eggs and babies. Mr. Gautam Saikia, a wildlife filmmaker and nature conservationist, was entrusted with the task, who was supported by a local NGO called Manus Moji Jandri of Ecotourism Society. Bodo Autonomous Council provided the monetary support and the forest department offered the logistics. The incubating python was constantly monitored and guarded. The python, however, never had left the eggs for a continuous period of 42 days during observation, after which she might have had decided that the eggs are ready for hatching and left the place. Soon ants and mites appeared in the scene and started to devious on the eggs. Mr. Gautam Saikya was keen to offer protection to the eggs and he immediately constructed a temporary incubator. There were 87 eggs in total and all of them were removed. The hatching started and in eight days all of them were successfully hatched. A hundred percent successful hatching of python under human protection is a rare and perhaps is the first ever exercise world over. While in the wild you know there are natural balance usually out of say 30-40 eggs Hardly a few survive. Of course, you don't know the exact quantum of survival here. It will 10 percent, 20 percent, something like that. Uh, since this is this was being monitored, and already human interference was there, uh, it was uh, it was right. It was it was right thing you did, of bringing it to a safe place and to ensure maximum hatching successful. The baby pythons were the fetus immediately after birth. However, they were sheltered at a nursery for further observation. After 24 hours of sheltering and observation, Mr. Saikia felt that the babies were perfectly fit for a wild environment. They are released in batches in different zones of the national park with the hope that the balance in the ecosystem is conserved. <laughs> 